Um, the variable is k. So what I did was I added k and 2 because it says that Kyoko is twice as well. So with 2 plus k equals 3k. And then plus 4 because Tishioko is 4 years more. So then I divided 3 to 75, which gave me 25. And then I subtracted 25 by 79, equals, it gave me 54. Very nice. And what is k equals 25? What does 25 represent, Danielle? Kyoko's age. Kyoko's age. In years, in months, in days, in years. Nice job. Very nice. Nice method. Now, what approach did you see Annabella different there? Uh, there that you know, kind of how the way that she divided. The way she divided? Yeah, and then that she didn't subtract the 4. I guess it started like that. And okay. I subtracted the 4 at the beginning. Okay. Interesting. Did she get the correct answer? Yes. yes. She did. She did. It makes sense. So far, it makes sense. Okay, Ernesto, let's hear from you, please. Yeah, I just got K. Um, because, like, I forgot to do the other half. I didn't know how to really do the other half, so I just did for K. Okay. Um, I put 2K plus 4 mm -hmm. plus X and equals 79. Mm -hmm. And then I, I divide, I put negative uh, 4. To the other side, negative 4, I scratch mm -hmm. that out. I put 2K plus X equals 75, mm -hmm. and I add them. So it, so it gives mm -hmm. me 3K equals 75. Mm -hmm. So then I put a, then I, then I divide it with 3, with 75, then I got K equals 25. Okay, so it kind of sounds like, just like you said, you focused on Kyoko. Yeah. Okay, so Kyoko is 25. Let's go back to the problem. Um, Toshibo is four years more than twice as old as Kyoko, if there's some. Now here, what do you recommend that he can do here? He did the correct process here, okay, and he got 3K. However, are these considered like terms? No. no. What are like terms? The same variable. Same variable. So what I, I want one of you to recommend what he should do to this variable to make this statement true. Change the X to a K. Excellent. So erase that and change that to a K. Now that they're the same variable, are they like terms? Yeah. yeah. Now you can add them like you did. Okay, so you got Kyoko's age. Yeah. Together equals 79. So how do you find the difference there? How do you find what Toshi, Toshihiki, Hiko, how old Toshihiko is? I divide you divide. Okay, let's look at the different strategies. It's a good approach, but I don't know if it's going to give you. You divide it here, yeah. and that's how you got it. Good. Danielle, explain how you got T for him, um, which is Toshihiko. Oh, you want, yeah, call on your partner. Call on your partner. Nesta, you can call on your partner too. Get your partner up here. You guys worked on it together. Represent that problem. Go ahead. Okay. Well, what she did was subtract 79 minus 25, which is the sum 79. Since it's the sum of both ages together, she subtracted what she got for the K. And it gives you 54, which is the, the age for the T. Okay. All right. So now, Ernesto, call on your partner, Annabella, here. Let's try to figure this out. Okay, so show the subtraction on the side so we can find the difference, what's left over, because that must be, Daniela, if we subtract it, the difference, that answer must be what? The, the age of Toshihiko. That's right, the age of Toshihiko. Yeah. So Toshihiko's age. Oh, look at this. Ka Look at this. Come on up. Come on up. Go up to the board. She came up with a different method than the three groups up there right now. Listen to what she's saying. It just going through all the equation again. Just go. Since it tells you that Toshihiko is four more and times two than ki Kyoko, then you do times two equals 50 and then plus the four equals 
equals 54, and that's 30 equals H. Oh. Very nice job. My role in this lesson was really a facilitator. Uh, if you noticed, uh, the students came up with their methods of solving. Uh, I was just facilitating the process, guiding them, using questions to make sure I guided them in the direction. But I was trying to draw out the responses from them. I wanted them to come up with the answers. It was more like a discovery uh, lesson for them. I could understand it better once I passed the words because um, those words, because I, was a, I, I am an ISO student. I can't quite understand it. I need help, and uh, my partner and the teacher was there to help me.